everyone, here we are again with another review of U.S. Army Reviews. Today, I got Hayes. And, <laughs> yeah, let's just, it'll be, let's just say this one's going to be short, because I don't really need to get into detail about this one. Don't buy it. Don't, it's not worth $60. Either a rent, or a trash can. Yeah, it's. Not, don't use 60 bucks on this game. Call of Duty 4, and there's many other ones out there that are much better than this. Alright, storyline. Okay, nothing extraordinary, very predictable. And the commentary, the voice acting, terrible. Absolutely terrible. It just pisses you off after 10 minutes of playing the game. Oh, it... I don't know. The storyline's okay. It's interesting, but it's very predictable, like I said. And just the voice acting just pisses you off. All these pops of the item. Yo, whatever. The graphics, once again, nothing special. Cannot compare it to Call of Duty 4. It looks like garbage at many times of the game. The texture's messed up. This, I mean, when you play Call of Duty 4 and then put this game in, you're just like... Mm. And this game's supposed to be newer, it's supposed to be PS3 exclusive, it should be built for this hardware, it should look good. No. No. Not even close. It's just not graphically there, not at all. I mean, especially with games like Metal Gear Solid 4 coming out in less than about two weeks. I don't know about you, but if you've seen the gameplay footage of that game, yeah, that'll blow your mind. The gameplay. Uh... Nothing new here either, it's just your standard FPS controls, um, just walking around, you know, crouch, shoot, everything. Everything you expect from a first person shooter. Nothing, they don't do anything to surprise you, make the game unique. Other than strictly when you're on, with part of Mantle, it lights up your enemies so it's easy to see. That's okay, whoop de doo And, but the aiming system, either way, is still garbage really really difficult I mean you get it down after the first 15 minutes of playing but it's still, it still just doesn't feel right I don't know once again you're not trying to compare games to others but when you have to drop $64.94 including tax on each one of these games this game is not def definitely not worth that money when there's other titles out there let's just put it that way the online You've heard it before, nothing new, nothing special, nothing worth $60. If you want to rent it, check it out. It's cool. Alright. But, I mean, come on. This game, I'm telling you people, don't spend 60 bucks on it. I played this game through in about six and a half hours with my buddy over here. No, it's done in six and a half hours to begin with, and it's not worth $60. And then when you see game, garbage controls, garbage graphics, online, nothing. it's just nothing new, nothing special, stick to Call of Duty, Metal Gear's coming out soon, if you want to play it, rent it, just don't drop 60 bucks, believe me, alright, so my final take is a 6 out of 10, that is because it's an okay shooter, but it's nothing new, nothing special, this is next gen hardware, this is what we're supposed to be doing, it's supposed to be good, but no, too much hype for this game, and just not worth 60 bucks. Go rent it. Or find something in the trash can. You might find something just as interesting. But anyway, six six out of ten. And I'll end it pretty quickly here with saying that um remember I'm part of the DOB network. That's gonna be coming on June seventh, the official site. DLB network.com. That's where you get me, Silver Canine, Sandman, and the rest of the DLB crew with the podcast and everything all conveniently on one site. It's going to be hot. It's going to be amazing. Better be there. Otherwise, I'll find you and beat you because this site's going to be legit. DLB has put a lot of time into it. It's going to be sick. I'll tell you what. Very soon. And that is just, what is it? Just about five or six days before Metal Gear Solid 4 launches. And be prepared. I'm going to have a huge review on that game. I'm going to bring my boy Snake00 in with me on that review. And I'm going to have footage from the midnight release at my local GameStop. I might even try and throw in there a couple interviews with a couple customers who are pretty ecstatic about the game. So be prepared for that. Alright guys, 
subscribe to the videos, go to the site, get ready for it June 7th, and then June 12th, big month. Peace.